Today we play Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom and we go to Kakariko Village and there is a cool boss rush that we do there also. There are so many people that need help and it is fun to help out on these little side quests. It really seems like we're getting very powerful in this game and we're getting so many upgrades, strong abilities and so many rupees from exploring. I'm so happy to be continuing this series, thank you so much for watching and I really hope you enjoy this video. Okay so it looks like the way that we want to go is we want to exit Hyrule Town right now and we are going to be heading up to probably- wait, what is this? Who is the Echo? How do I begin to narrow this down? Your Highness, I was just muttering to myself. Uh, I suppose I could confide in you, Princess Zelda. My name is Beecher. General Wright has asked me to look into a highly sensitive matter. You see, after the rift was mended, we noticed there was one extra soldier in Castletown. General White believes this to mean one of them is an echo, hidden among our ranks. So he asked me to see if any of the soldiers seemed suspicious, but my investigation has hit a wall. When I started looking at them more closely, they all seemed suspicious. You're not a soldier, so I know you're not the echo. Could you help me find this out? That's so funny. Oh, thank you so much. I've been tying myself in knots over this, I tell you. I haven't heard that expression. All right. What we know so far is there's one soldier too many in Castletown. Would you mind interviewing them all and trying to suss out the echo? At this point, I'm so mixed up that I'm seeing echoes everywhere. I look that's so funny okay I definitely would like to do that side quest sometime but first 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 the first thing that we have to do is the main quest I'd love to continue with the main quest did you guys wait what in the world what is that there's a wolf of some sort go go wolf oh, oh man that's a strong wolf my goodness and now we learned this wolf ability wolfos Reminds me so much of the Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess, but yeah, now we can use that wolf to attack others. Wait, I wonder if we could attack that bird up there. Maybe we could sneak up to that bird. Let's see, maybe we could go like this. No, the bird is probably gonna notice us, right? Unless I could get it from here. Can I, can I target the bird? Let's see. Come here. I don't think we can hit it. Unless I go like this. No, I don't think we could get that bird. There's no way we could get that bird, right? Yeah, I don't think that bird is gettable. Okay, so anyways, let's see. What way are we going? Okay, we need to go to the left over here. There's some small town here that we are going to run into on our way over, and you know what? Oh, that seemed kind of suspicious to me. But yeah, there's just so much to do and so much to explore in this game, which is really cool. Whoa, these are interesting trees. Okay, let's come on up here. Whoop. I can jump so much higher now, it's so nice to be- Oh, this is Hyrule Ranch, I see. What is there to do here? I got some milk somewhere else. One of our horses went missing. We looked all over, but we just couldn't find a- What about you? We'll all- we've all been real sad since one of our horses went missing. You can go talk to Grandpa about it. He's the wrinkly guy over there. <laughs> That's a funny way to describe him. Oh, maybe I could take one of the horses. Okay, nice, you can talk to a cow also. Where could she be? Ah, welcome to Hyrule Ranch. I'm afraid we're not loaning out mounts at the moment. We're a bit distraught, see? One of our horses went and ran off. Hardly out of the usual for her to gallop out west. What's odd is she hasn't come back. The whole family went looking, but we didn't find her. If you see our horse, I don't suppose you'd mind bringing her back here? Oh, they said the horse ran away somewhere out west? Well, we kind of are going this way. Maybe the horse is somewhere over here. Maybe we'd be able to get the horse. A horse, of course, that's what we need. And... Wait, there it is! Whoa, that was easy to find. What are you doing here, horsey? Wait, horse riding. To ride a horse, press A to mount the horse. Use the joystick to move. Dismount with B at any time. Can we jump? Am I gonna get you out of here? What if we go into the water? Jump! Uh-oh! <laughs> this doesn't seem like a good idea. What if we go... If you go in the water? Okay, then the horse just responds there. Do I have to build some kind of bridge for the horse, or what? I have a trampoline I guess I could use. Can the horse go on a trampoline? Here's a trampoline. Let's go. Oh no, that didn't work! <laughs> it almost worked. It was close to working. Oh, 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 Okay, 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 guys, this might work, this might work. Hold on. Let's dismount. And let's put down a trampoline right here, right on the edge. Let's see if this will be good enough. Let's go! No! Not like that. Let's get ready, let's get ready. Hopefully this works. Ride the horse. No! Oh, you gotta bounce, bro! Or wait, 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 you know what else we could do? Hold on, we could go like this. We could get the horse, come on up here. Now wait here. Take one more step. 
Now face that way. Okay, let's dismount. This is what we're gonna do. We can put down a bed here, actually. Wait. Yeah, I, I actually probably don't even need the trampoline. The horse can probably get up that. Yeah, okay, there we go. That's great. All right. I was thinking we have to bounce off of a trampoline with the horse. But this is great. Is the horse even any faster than running? Oh, whoops. I meant to uh, jump after, jump over that, but B is dismount. Where could she be? There we go. I brought your horse. The horse isn't even that much faster, is it? Say, that's our horse. She's finally back home where she belongs. I can't thank you enough. Yeah, not a problem. Who would have thought it? The poor girl ended up in a place like that. She and I are both in your debt. Tell you what, Sprout, if you ever need a steed, I'll lend them to you free of charge. Horses are great for getting places quickly. You can go ahead and saddle up on whichever one you'd like. Hooray! That's so nice. Wait, which is the one that I saved? Okay, this is obviously not the one because that is a dog. Let's take this one. Let's go. Oh, you can dash. That makes you go a bit more quickly. Okay, and let's read this sign. Kakariko Village or Hyrule Castle. Okay, we don't want to go to either of those. Oh, but look at this. A teleport spot. That's good news. Or wait, maybe we are going to Kakariko Village because it looks like we do want to go left and up a little bit. So let's take our horse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice, I can just charge through enemies, which is nice. And I'm guessing we've got to run up here. Wait. Oh, no, no, no. We have seen those before. Oh, no, if you're not going quickly, then you do get hurt. Oh, and you don't destroy grass as you run through it. Look out, guys. Look out, guys. Wait, this is going to be one of the smoothie shops. Hello there. Can we make some smoothie? Whoa, someone's coming to attack us in the middle of us making a smoothie. Okay, what did we not make yet? We made mango. We didn't use our gold egg yet. Twisted pumpkin. Faster key winding speed. What does faster key winding speed mean? Well... Let's try mixing that. Oh wait, not with fresh milk. Let's try this. Twisted pumpkin and floral nectar. Let's see if that makes anything. You got it. We get. Oh, we got something new. Sweet twisty smoothie. Nice. I'd like to make some more, please. Let's do. Wait, we didn't do anything with bubble kelp, did we? That lets you hold your breath longer underwater. I don't think we ever made one of those. Oh, and we do have to go back to the other uh, shop owner in the water area. Oh, that doesn't make anything. That is so sad. What if I mix together two of these? An especially flavorful seaweed. Maybe we could mix a hot pepper and this together. I don't know if that'll go well together. No, that also doesn't work. Okay, so we have to find out what to make with our hot peppers. Wait, you know what would be really good together, actually? Probably seahorse. It allows you to swim faster. And this one lets you hold your breath. If we could combine those two together, that'd be amazing. Let's see if that works. Hey, we got something! A rapid smoothie. Amazing, that's so cool. Okay, and Milk says it boosts the healing effect of the drinker by a lot. Maybe we can mix milk and butter together? Wait, 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 wait. It looks like there are a lot of recipes. Hold on, look at this. That's number 46. So that means that there are at least 46 recipes. My goodness. You know, let's try milk and butter. We have so much. It'll be fine to try. Let's see. It, it did make something! Milky Radiant Smoothie, nice! Wait, maybe we can combine butter with things when used in a drink? Yeah, because that becomes milky something, maybe we could combine butter and grapes or butter and apples or something. Let's try that, because we have so much of this. Let's see. You got it. Yes, it is! Refreshing Mixed Smoothie, very nice. Okay, and that should be 10 recipes now. Now, if I'm not mistaken, two, four, six, ten. that's it! You made all the recipes we asked for! With that many items on the menu, every customer will find something to like. Here's your reward for helping expand the shop's menu. Oh, we get... A survey scope. This special spyglass makes smoothie ingredients and monster stones appear a little more often when you break objects or defeat monsters. That's so cool! You've been a huge help! We've got plenty on the menu! Uh, that's what I'd like to say, but... Now that we've experienced the cool mouthful of suc- The cool mouthful. Now that we've experienced the cool mouthfeel of success, I want to expand our menu again. What do you say to making 10? No, 20 more new recipes! We'll make it worth your while! Alright, that's pretty cool. What if I do apples? and butter. Maybe that will be something. Let's see. You get... Apple Radiant Smoothie. I think that's also a new one. I could try butter and cactus. I wonder if that'll be something. Let's try that. That looks new. 
Mixed Radiant Smoothie. Wait, I don't know if we already have that one or not. Maybe I could try a pumpkin and butter. That sounds like it could go together. Let's try that. Oh, and I didn't try pumpkin and mango, but that's probably just mixed radiant smoothie or something. This one is pumpkin radiant smoothie. Nice, nice. There's another new one. And let's go like that. Mango and butter. What will that give us? That is mixed tough smoothie. Okay. I wonder how many smoothies I could hold. You know what? Let's try rock salt in something. What if I cook two rock salt? Will that be anything? No, that's just a failure. Okay, because I had so much rock salt, I thought, you know, I might as well try it. Wait, what about kelp and salt? Or kelp and spice? Let's try kelp and salt. Oh, that actually makes something, nice! Salted bubble smoothie, wow! I didn't try butter and salt yet, did I? Let's try that. Man, this butter's a great ingredient. We can basically cook everything with it. This makes salted radiant smoothie, nice! How about the hot pepper? And the salt. Let's try that. No, that is not good. So sad. How about a monster fang and butter? Because we haven't done anything good with monster fangs yet. So let's try that. We're almost out of butter though. We get... Radiant Potion. Okay, nice. Maybe we should sell some stuff. Okay, you know what? We should put on that accessory that we got. Ah, uh, do we want this one? I don't care too much about hearts appearing right now. I think this one is better. Oh, and I can actually choose what clothing I want to wear. I can swap to my disguise. Ah, interesting. Okay, cool. And I guess this is probably one of the stamps that we want to collect. Hooray! Three out of five stamps collect. Oh, I thought the guy was going to show up. I guess he doesn't show up every time. Okay, let's take our horse with us into town. This must be Kakariko Village. And hold on. Oh, right around here is somewhere that we have to go. Still not back yet, I see. Let's have a- Wait! My horse just disappeared! Oh, Princess Zelda, hello! I'm here on the King's orders to help look for rifts. The villagers say that rifts appeared on Elden Volcano and up in Goron City. Apparently, the Gorons haven't been spared in all this either. The Gorons have always been good neighbors. We're pretty worried about them. They've got a new leader recently, but that's all we've heard. We don't know how to help them. We'd love to help them with the rift, but we're not cut out for the terrain and the monsters up there. That does appear to be all we know, your highness. The Gorons will probably be able to tell us about the large rift. Yeah. Okay, oh, and you're saying still not back yet. Where could that little scamp have gotten off to? Oh, excuse me, young miss. Would you mind listening to an old man's tale of heartbreak? Yeah, of course. You see, I can't find my cat anywhere, not what I was expecting. She's often with the other cats in town. I wish I had a way to ask them if they've seen her. Ah, if only I had a suit of cat clothes for moments like this. Cat clothes? Oh, they're magical outfits to let you understand cat speech. There was a set at the shop here in the village, but someone snapped them up before I could. It was that young lady that's usually in front of the shop there. I can't exactly ask to borrow an outfit she just bought, can I? Yeah, that'd be a bit strange, wouldn't it? What to do, what to do? Oh, that's interesting. Oh, and this arch over here reminds me of some Italian towns that are super cool. There are some small Italian towns where there are these big archways and they're built on top of hills. They are super cool to see. This was Mario. This is Mario Odyssey. We'd be able to go down that pipe. Okay, now where's the shop? I love how we can jump higher now. Wait, where's my horse? Okay, my horse is still here. Don't want to lose my horse. Oh, wait, we could probably go down the well here like this. I was thinking, why is the well covered? Let's go down the well, of course. There's got to be something here. Right? Oh, nice. Just a treasure over here. That's cool. Bottom of the well. And we get money or what? Oh, grapes. Nice. Got any grapes? Just three grapes. That is fine. Now let's climb on up out of the well. That's so funny that that was right there. Okay, wait, this isn't the shop, is it? Wait, were those grapes down there? Oh, sleeping kid, someone over here. Whoa, Link, welcome! Hey, I'm not Link. Oh, sorry, that hood looks just like Link's. He's the young man who saved my children. Oh, that's nice. Okay, well, if you happen to run into Link, would you tell him to drop by? Man, Link just helps so many people. It reminds you of the movie Groundhog Day, one of my favorite movies ever. It's such a good idea to go around and just help people however you can. What is in here? Oh, hello. Hello. Wait, you look like, is it Blaine? For some reason, he reminds me of Blaine from Pokemon. Oh-ho! Are you a new recruit? Don't answer yet. First, put on your listening ears. You're in the Slumber Dojo, the only dojo where you train via your dreams. I know, I know, training makes it sound like a spiritual journey or whatever, but it's real simple. First, I show you a dream, an astounding dream based on your life. Then, within that dream, you defeat all the foes trying to get you. That's the whole training. Each training session has a goal time. Beat the goal, and I'll have a special reward for you. Oh, and there's a sword up there. Maybe we could have that. Wait, we did something like this where we won a golden fan. Best part is, since this is all in your dreams, you wake up without a scratch every time. But hold on! 
Join now, and all your training sessions are free of charge. You're thinking, where do I sign? Ooh. But there's even more. If you keep at your training, there will be an astounding reward as proof of your skill. <laughs> all right, are you ready to do some training? Or are you ready to do some training? I'm ready to do some training. Oh, you will? Oh, then you are now an official student of the Slumber Dojo. Let's get you training right away. Here is our menu of dream options. Ha 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 ha. Oh, this is so, whoa, you could refight some of the uh, bosses, I guess. Goal time, 10 minutes or 10 seconds? That must be 10 minutes. Oh, that's so interesting. This is so interesting. Let's do it. Take on this training. Your training begins now. Do I go to sleep first or what? Do I just lie down? He nods. Close your eyes. Okay, we close our eyes. Feel your energy flowing within you. Ha! For this training, all you have is your rod. Your experience and inventory will be sealed off, so be ready. Your goal time is 60 seconds. Begin! Okay. Wait! Uh-oh! Uh-oh! That didn't work well. Oh, 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 so I guess I have to relearn everything. Go. Uh-oh. Can I do anything with this? I don't know if this will really help me. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's go pick up this. Whoa! Come here. Come here. Oh, I broke them. Not good. Not good. I should learn this ability, I guess. There we go. Learn the rock echo. Uh-oh. Wanted to hit the bat, but that didn't work. Man, this guy is so strong. Yes! There we go. I learned him now. Okay, I wonder if that's the way to go. Is that the best way to go about this? No, no, no. That's not what I want. I want this guy. Go! Oh, and I set that guy on fire. I didn't even mean to do that. I did that by accident. Fight Ab! Hit Ab! Go! Why can't you do it? Let's fight this guy. Go! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! There we go! There we go! There we go! Time's almost up. Time's almost up. I could probably use this Octo Rock to defeat the to defeat this thing. Go! 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 Come here. Get him. Get him, get him, get him, please! No! We're over a minute! No! We just failed! That's so sad! I can't believe how sad that is! That is so sad! Bad news! You didn't succeed in time! Don't give up, though! You can try again any time! Yeah, let's try again. Okay, now I think I know what to do. Here's my idea. Now that we know how this works, let's learn this rock. That's how we should start. And then we could probably throw a rock at this guy. Defeat him quickly, which is very nice. Then we can put down this Octo Rock. The Octo Rock can probably do good at defeating this goblin guy over there. Go get him. There we go. And while he's doing that, we could learn this ability, and then we could use the fire to defeat the guy that is up there. Uh oh, that didn't work as planned. Let's go again. Defeat him. Defeat him. No, 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 no. Shoot at this guy, obviously. Okay, fine. You can get the bat. Okay, you got the bat, that's good. Put down a fire right there, set that guy on fire. And now we just have to defeat this guy. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Do it. Go, 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 go. Can I sit down more than one at a time? Nope, I can only have one down at a time. Oh no, I can't have down more than one at a time. There we go. Can I have a third? There we go. Easy. Now that we know how to do it, it's easy. Okay, and I can sit down more than one at a time. Done in 39.49 seconds. Lickety split, you're even faster than the goal time. That was great slumbering. Let me give you a reward. Hey, nice, we get some apples. Apples! And speed like that makes you quite the power napper. Performance like that deserves a special reward. Hooray, five jars of floral nectar, very nice. If you pass training just one more time, I'll have an astounding reward for you. All right, let's go do another one. I'm ready. Caromadillo's Revenge. Defeat all the foes. That looks like a lot of Caromadillos. Man, how are we gonna do this one? For this training, you have to rely on your skills alone. You won't be able to use drinks. Okay, got it, got it, got it. I guess if I hit this switch, the jail probably comes down. And these guys are gonna come down. Uh-oh. How do I, uh... How, how can I even defeat these guys? Wait. Oh, I have all of my abilities now. Okay, so I can do whatever I want here. Go. Oh man, this is gonna be a tough one, I think. What else can I use? Maybe these guys will be good? Send out a bunch of these? Are these good or no? 
No, they don't seem too good. Maybe one of these. Go! Attack! Attack somebody! Come on! Come on now! Man, these guys are just bouncing around like crazy. What else can I do? Can I... S oh, I can swap into this link! Okay, this is the way to go. This is the way to go. Uh-oh. Let's go. There we go. Almost got them all. Go! There we go. Finished. Very nice. Oh, man! I'm surprised at that time we were able to transform into Link. I think in the previous one, maybe we couldn't. Okay, so that's great. What's the reward this time? Oh, nice. A Monster Fang. Lovely. Five Monster Fangs, actually. Ah! You dream big and advance to another level. Training is like the whetstone of sleep. Ha 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 ha. As promised, I've got something astounding for you in recognition of your sleepy progress. Cool! A heart piece. Very nice. If you pass training just two more times, I'll have an astounding reward for you. Okay, let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready. Wait, how come this one is that symbol and this one has a check mark? I wonder if they'll all have something different. Defeat the enemies without being swept away by the current. This one looks so hard. Okay, for this training, you have to rely on your skills alone. You won't be able to use drinks or items. Okay, got it. Goal time is 1.30. Wait, is there actually a... Uh-oh! I, I wonder if they mean you actually can't be swept away at all. Do I fail now? Oh no, I don't fail. Let's go. Gotta go and defeat those spiders that get up here. Okay, now uh, maybe you can defeat that guy. Good. Now how can I defeat this guy up here? Maybe send out one of these. Can you get the spider or no? Go get the spider. No, the spider's running away. How can I get the spider up there? Oh wait, I know what I can do. I can go like this. Oh. There we go, the spider is destroyed now. Okay, nice. Is there anyone else up here? Okay, there's a spider over there. And there's stuff over here. Okay, let's go like this. I can defeat you like that. I can hit you with that. Wait, you're not defeated! Takes more arrows than that to defeat you. Come on. There we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, you're all defeated. We're about halfway through. And we still have to go the other way. Uh-oh. But I'm gonna need one of these to get up on. There we go. Now let's go here. Uh-oh. Let's see. Time's almost up. Time's almost up. Is there anyone to defeat there or no? Get up! Get up, Zelda! Get up! Let's go. Go! There we go. Come on, get up, get up, get up. Is this the final one or no? Get up! Don't just stand there! Come on, come on, come on. Come on. I missed. Oh! No! We failed! We failed. That is so sad. So sad! <laughs> Wait, and maybe that isn't even the final one. Let's just see if that works. No, that wasn't even the final one. Okay. Man, getting stuck behind these things, or under them, is really quite the event. Okay, but it looks like using these. Yeah, that's a good way to take out those. Okay, I got it. I got it. Okay, now we know how it works. Okay. Just one more to do. One more to do. Come on now. Come on now. Just jump. 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 No, that's not a jump! Don't get swept away! Come on now. Come on now. Go! Please defeat that thing! Please go and defeat that thing! Up there, up there, up there! You guys can do it! You guys can do it! Come on! So close, so close, so close, so close! No! Point two, two, too slow! Okay, I think we can do it this time, maybe. Let's go. Let's get that guy from here. There we go. That's great. Now, we just have to make it over to there. Are there any nice things that we can jump on? Come on, now. Well, I guess I could also go like this. Get up here. Okay, now whack that with the sword. Very nice. Get up, get up. Let's come here. Uh-oh. Get onto this one, maybe. Get onto that one. There we go. Okay. Not making amazing time. We are a little bit slower than before. Oh, but that was great. 
Now, can I get onto this one? Let me get on, please. There we go, there we go, there we go. Let's get ready. Yeah, we're actually quite a bit slower than last time right now, but maybe we can get lucky here. Let's do this. Get up! Stop falling! No! Okay, this is good. Now, can you guys defeat this one here? There we go. That's some good movement. Nope, never mind. Get out of my way, bro! Okay, here we are, 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 here we are. We can do it. Go, you guys can all defeat that thing. Go, 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 go. Go. There we go, easy. 109. Now we got it 20 seconds faster than required. My goodness. That was great slumbering. Let me give you a reward. Thank you. Okay, nice. Some kelp. Very nice. Performance like that deserves a special reward. Five river horses. Very nice. All right, let's see. What's next? Wait, is it the boss fight next? Let's see. Blank slate battle wind. Start with no echoes and no items allowed. Defeat your enemies using only what's available in the dream. One minute and five seconds left. I thought that they would all... Wait, 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 wait. Wait, hold on. Since we have to use the wind, does that mean that we have to blow these guys into the holes? Maybe that's what we have to do. Okay, let's try this. Here's an idea. Let's go like this. Whoops. Put one down here. There we go. Blew that guy down there. Now, what else can we do? Hmm, I can learn the tables, but so what? Let's see, let's see. Okay, this guy's coming here. Let's go like this. There we go, another one's coming here. Come on. Come here. Come here. There we go, got that one, which is nice. Okay, need you guys to come here. Come here. There we go. Oh, and you know what else I could do? I could probably... Oh, I could probably use some tables and move these guys where I want them to go. Go there. There we go. Now, let's see. What am I going to do with you guys? I'd love to get up there. You know what? I should probably use a little table to get up. Then I can go like this. Not a lot of time left. Not a lot of time left here. Whoa, look out. Oh, man. And what can I do to get this guy out of the way? Let's go. Need you guys to come here. Need you guys to come here. No! Time's almost up yet. Yeah. Come on. Ah, man. Just two, three seconds too short. No. Or too long, I mean. Okay, this has definitely been the hardest one yet. I think by far. The other ones weren't too bad. But this one. Man. I guess there are different ways of doing it. And you have to just find the right way to do it. Okay, so there we go. We learned the table. Now, hold on. How many of the guys can we lure over here? I can lure you guys over here. Can I lure you guys over also? Come here, guys. Come here, guys. Come here, everybody. Why doesn't everybody just come here? There we go. And one more down here. Whoops! Not that way. Not that way. Like this. There we go. That's lovely. Whoops! I fell in now. Okay, that wasted a little bit of time. Okay, why don't you guys come over here, the two of you? That'll be lovely if you guys could just come here. And... There we go. Got you both. That's great. Now, hold on. Can I push this out of the way? Yes, I can. So, that's nice. Now, come here. And I think as you come here, you'll get blown in there. Now, I just need this guy. Is this the last guy? Hey! Hey! Notice me! Notice me! Are you the final guy? Come here! Come here, bro. I think we might be making it. I think this is the last guy. Come here! Come here! Come here! Come here! Come! Come on! Come on! Oh, man, if you had to get sub one minute, that would have been awful. I would have been about 0.242 slow, but that's great that we got that. Not bad. Okay, let's see. What is the reward? Nice, we got five pieces of chili cactus. And what else? Something astounding. Oh, the first mastery. It is a scroll of Shiso's extremely specific teachings. Equip it to slightly slow energy loss when you're in sword fighter form. That sounds pretty useful. Okay. If we do two more, then we get something nice. Let's keep going. Oh, maybe every second one is blank? No, no, but that doesn't make sense because this one we were able to use our abilities, this one we were able to use our abilities, but the first one we weren't and the uh, fourth one we weren't. Okay, Titan's Gathering. Face a gauntlet of the mightiest foes you've braved so far. Oh, so I guess there are probably multiple enemies. 
Close your eyes. Let's get ready. For this training, your material possessions will be available. Fight with everything. Your goal time is 10 minutes. Man, imagine if we just fail by a few seconds. That'd be awful. Okay, let's skip because we know how this boss fight works. Can I attack you already? <laughs> oh man, that's too good. That's too good. Okay, let's see. Now we gotta get you on your arm there. Can I aim at it and get you with arrows? Okay, that's fine. Now I can come up here. There we go, and... Okay, pretty good so far. This is going nice and quick. Okay, now what? Are you getting angry? You're an angry guy over there. Okay, let's go like this. We gotta pull this off his head. Come on. There we go, there we go. Now, can I just attack it? Let's go. And, is it defeated? 34.81 seconds, first boss is defeated? Because if yes, then that's a great start. Okay, let's see what's next. Wait, am I going to have to face the water boss also? The water one is so hard. Okay, it looks like the water boss is next. Oh man, this is definitely the hardest boss fight. Or, well, probably the- oh no, and I don't have my energy renewed. Let's see. Let's come up here. Let's go. I don't want to use up too much of that. Okay, can I make somebody else attack you? Who's good? I think my shark was good here. Good job, shark. Good job. Now, let's attack some more. Okay, nice. Already at this part of the boss fight, which is pretty good. But now then, how am I going to damage you here? Oh, maybe like this. Go! No, I can't attack it right now. And I'm all out of that. That's not good. Okay, who should I send to attack you? Who can I send to attack you up there? Maybe P-Hat? Go, P-Hat! Uh-oh. Gotta watch out for the tornadoes. Go, P-Hat! Whoops, wrong way. Whoa, man! Go, P-Hat! Can you attack it? Yes! And, ah, uh, if only I could attack it with something. What can I attack it with? What can go there? Maybe these guys. Go! No! They can't jump that high! Maybe another P-Hat. Go, P-Hat! No, don't go back into the water. Okay, well maybe I can send a shark down as you come here. Go. Yes, that's a good shark. That's a good shark. Okay, now you're going to spin, right? Or what? Go, P-Hat. Wait, what happened to my P-Hat? Go. Go. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Now who can attack you here? Who can attack you here? Who would be good at attacking here? Could I just drop some of these on it? Nope. There we go. Go! That looks like it's hurting a bit. Uh-oh. I'm almost dead. This is not good. And this boss fight is certainly tougher than the others. This could be a good time to use my uh, potion to uh, heal up a bit. Okay, but we should probably send out a P-Hat here. Go. Let's go. Nope, we got hit. That's okay. Let's sneak up through here. We want to come down. And... Go! 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 Go up! Come on! Gotta hit it some more! Go, P-Hat! Okay, I guess I gotta send this shark now, because it's coming down here. Go, shark! Ah, oh, that was not good at all. Not very good at all. Go! Nope, 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 nope. Oh man, and soon we have to face Molly Molly. That's a big one! Okay, now go, he hat Get those. Nice. And now, how do I defeat you? What should I do? Drop these on you or what? Yep. 
go. Get up there. Go on, guys. Come on. Attack. Ah, what else can I send to attack? What's good? Can I send one of you or no? Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay, that one is defeated. That's good. Oh, man. 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 Okay, now I have about six and almost half a minute to defeat this guy. Wait, I wonder if I also have to defeat Ganon. If I also have to defeat Ganon, then that is going to be crazy. Oh, man. 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 Okay, who was good against this guy? I think the sand piranhas were good against him, if I remembered correctly. Let's see. Go! Oh man, it'd be so much better if I could just use a bunch of potions. Let's see, where's he going? Is he gonna charge now? There we go. Let's see, where is he? Get him, guys! Okay, let's see. I really hope this is the final guy. I don't know if there's one more guy after this or not. Yeah, and we're not really getting any hearts or anything here. Is he gonna charge now? Run! Go, guys! You know what? This would be an amazing opportunity to... Oh, uh, maybe Dark Knight level 2 would be good, too. Oh, that was good. But wait, he's not defeated yet. Now it's just the next phase. I think there are two or three phases. Wait, I should probably put on the quicksand shoes now. Okay, and now he's flying. Yeah, that's right, I remember this. I don't care too much about this, but these sandals could help. I don't think I really have to jump too high either. Maybe this will make hearts appear, that could be nice. And I probably need to send sand piranhas after him now. Let's see. Whoa, look out! Look out! Gotta stay away from those! Okay, and... Come on down! Come on down so that we can attack you, my friends. Is he gonna charge now? Yep. There we go. Keep going, my friends. Keep going, my good piranhas. And does that send out any of the stuff that I want? No, it doesn't give us any hearts or anything. Let's go. Go, my sand piranhas. Attack this guy. Attack this guy. Can you guys jump up and attack him? They're not attacking him while he flies like that. Which is too bad. Maybe there's someone else that I could use to attack him while he flies. Okay, where's he gonna go now? We gotta get him, guys. We gotta get him, guys. Good job, good job. Go, guys! Uh-oh, I got hit by that. Not good. Go, guys! Ah, now he's flying. Maybe I could send out... Oh, wait, maybe a pea hat will work while he's flying. Let's try that. Okay, that did not look like it worked. Okay, because we get destroyed quite quickly. So I don't know if we have a chance to get him. Go! Okay, we're at six minutes so far. Almost six minutes. Let's send out some sand piranhas now. Go. Now he's going to charge. There we go. Go get him, guys! Is he gonna charge again? You can get him, guys! Good job, guys! Good job, guys! Come on, guys! Come on, guys! I really hope this is the final one. If we also have to face Ganon, then that is massive trouble. I don't think that we'd be able to do it. Because that boss fight itself, I could imagine it taking a bunch of time. Okay, but is there anything that I could use while he's flying? Maybe the spear-throwing guy? Could you throw a spear at him? Maybe you can. Go! Get him! Get him! Throw a spear! Come on, don't just stand there! Yeah! You got him! You threw a spear! Good job, bro! Okay, now I think that he's going to uh, come down now. Yep, so let's get some more of these. Let's be ready. Where's he coming out of there? Let's just keep running across. Whoa! Good job dodging that. Whoa! Okay, there we go. Dodge that. Come on now, we're almost at seven minutes. Let's go. Okay, and... Let's go like this. You guys can get him. Go get him. Go get him. Yeah, there we go. You guys are getting him. Oh my goodness, he almost took out my entire army. Wait, is he going to come down now? Yeah, he's going to come down now. Okay, so now we need these. Let's go. Let's go. Run! 
Come on, it's 720 already! We gotta defeat this guy. How much HP do you have, bro? Is he gonna fly now? Not yet. Let's go, let's go. Okay, now he's flying, so let's send out these. Let's go. Need another one here. Go, go, guys! There we go, there we go. Uh oh, no, but now he's flying, so now we need sand piranhas. Let's go. Go, sand piranhas! You can get him, sand piranhas! Uh oh, he's gonna charge. I forgot what attack he was going to do. Whoa, that was weird. It almost looked like he was gonna fly off the screen. Whoa, he's facing the wrong way. That was so funny. He's facing towards the corner there. Get him, guys! Nope, now he's this. Let's go. Let's go. Get him, guys! Let's go, guys! And... Okay, gotta use Sand Piranhas now, because he's coming down. 825 already! Come on, guys! Come on, guys, go get him! Come on, guys, we can get him! We can get him, guys! Go! Okay, flying again. Almost nine minutes. You know what? I should try using a potion, because I don't know how much HP he has left. I'm really hoping this is the final one. You know what? I could even use some of these mistake potions. Because look, that heals me quite a bit here. Let's get him. Let's go. Okay. Got him like that. Now when he comes down, I'm just going to attack him with the sword when we have an opportunity. And, wait, we want, uh... We want these, actually. Come here. I didn't get a chance to get him, no! Okay, after he attacks here. No! He dodged my head! There we go, but we got him! Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. I really hope this is the final one. If we also have to fight Ganon, then I'm definitely going to have to be using a lot of potions to make it through this. Let's see. Is that it? Yes! Thank you! Thank you, thank you, thank you. We got it. Open your eyes. There we go. Well done. Only 917.62. That's even faster than the cool time I gave you. That was great slumbering. Let me give you a reward. All right. Thank you. Five containers of fresh milk. If you pass just one more time, I'll have an amazing reward for you. Yeah, I'm ready. And there's one more that we can do currently. Defeat an unruly horde of moblins. For this training, you'll have to rely on your skills alone. You won't be able to use drinks. Okay, that's fine. Your goal time is 60 seconds. Begin. What will be good to take out these guys? You know what I think will be good? You know what I think could be good? Wait, I wonder if I could use the uh, floating tiles. Those might be good, but I think... Whoops. I'm thinking these might be good. Go. Go. Whoops. Uh, let's send in another one here. Let's go. Let's go. And like that. There we go. Oh, you guys are kind of spread out that way, though. Wait, you can damage these things? You guys can damage these? What in the world? Maybe I should just send out a Dark Nut. Go! Fight him! There we go! Dark Nut's the way to go. Or wait, I could probably attack them, too. Why don't I come and attack them? Let's go. Oh, and send out a Dark... Whoops! Uh, run! Send out a Dark Nut. And... I'll come and attack, too. There we go. Uh-oh. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Easy. There we go. Okay, perfect, perfect. Very easy. Nice. I kind of forgot that I could transform and attack, too. Done in 43.58 seconds. Look at me split. You're even faster than the goal time. That was great slumbering. Let me give you a reward. Wait, this isn't the incredible reward that he's talking about, is he? We're probably getting some other kind of... Accessory. I do believe I can now entrust this dojo's astounding katana to you. Need, eh? It's yours. I won't ask for it back, and you can use it however you like. Just don't go swinging it around or running with it. That would be dangerous. Haha, <laughs> very funny. Cool, we got the katana. You got an heirloom katana. Supposedly, this katana is so sharp, it can cut through anything. It was just collecting dust in the slumber dojo. Haha. <laughs> if you pass your training just two more times, I'll have an astounding reward for you. If you're looking for new training dreams, you'll need to go have some more experiences first. 
Ah, yeah, so that must be everything. Yeah, we've done everything so far, so I guess later in the game we can come back and get some more. What do you have to say? You're really into this training, huh? At first, I thought sleeping while standing up was just a weird trick to do, but you... You're making it seem like a really cool weird trick to do. Ha 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 ha. That's kind of cool that we've collected these items. Oh, and... The monster stones. I wonder if you can do anything with them, or if these are just collectibles. Well, anyways, that was sweet that we were able to do that. That's so nice. Come back! Wait, what do you need back? Come back! Hey, you! Could you lend me a hand? For some reason, my dear sweet Cuckoos decided to escape over the fence this morning. They're running away from me, the little rebels, and we were getting along so well. If you manage to get a hold of my Cuckoos, can you please bring them back in this pen? There are five in total. Please, I need your help. Okay, so... Yeah, we could definitely do that, and... Nice that there's a teleport spot right here. That's fantastic. Aw, oh, man, guys, this is so much fun. What an incredible game. Wait, wait, this must be the shop here. Oh, and there is a cuckoo right there in the bushes. This must be the shop. What's for sale here? Grapes, don't care. Wait, what is this? Yeah. Climbing band. A leather band that protects your wrist. Wear it to climb ladders and rock walls faster. That sounds kind of useful, but for 500 mm. coins, well, 500 rupees, that's pretty steep. I heard that Gorons, those folks up on the volcano, they eat rocks! How does that not give them the most horrible indigestion? Welcome, welcome! Need any assistance? Kind of funny that you could sell Monster Stone for just five golden eggs, though. That's a lot of money. I could get a lot of money from selling some gold eggs. Okay, are you the one that just bought the outfit? Oh, yes, I bought a suit of cat clothes! I mean, they let you talk to cats! How could I not buy them on the spot? What I plain forgot is that any time I get close to a cat, I bust out sneezing. It's a real shame. I just bought them, and I'll have to put them straight into storage. Oh, you're looking for some cat clothes? What is this, like Super Mario 3D World? You get the cat bell? Ah, uh, well, can I ask you a favor? If you do it, I'll just give you the cat clothes. Look over there, you see that cat? Yeah. What is it? There's something important to me buried right where it's sitting. And? Would you mind digging it up for me? The cat refuses to move, and if I get too close, I'll be sneezing all over the place. I was about to give up. Wait, I don't have a shovel or anything. Maybe you could lure it away with something it likes? Uh, well, I have some fish. I do have some fish. Or, well, I can get some fish, I should say. Okay, let's throw this in there. That has to go in there, right? There's one, right? I'm missing four. Okay, okay, so it looks like once I put one away, then they're going to stay there. I wonder, was that other cuckoo actually in the bushes? Did it get revealed when I cut through the bushes, or was it just around here? I'm so glad that we have the band that lets you jump higher now. That's so useful. So nice to be able to jump high like that. And I wonder if all of the cuckoos are in the village. Wait, where is that entrance that we were just at? Hold on, there are a bunch of people right by the start. Oh, here's another one. There we go, there's a the second one. Too bad I can't dash while carrying this. Okay, can you get in there? There we go. That's two. Oh, so cool how I can jump up here. Okay, any other ones around here? Ah, uh, some kid in a windmill. Oh, there's another one up here. Okay, here's some kind of graveyard. There's a third one. That's nice, okay. You can get down. Oh, and you fall so slowly when you're carrying them. That's so useful. Wait, is this one right here? Yep, there's another one. Let's get it. Okay, can you get in there? There we go, that's four. Yeah, and this is the one that I was talking about. This is the one that we saw around here. Now, where could the last one be? Let's see. Well, here's this cat. Let's talk to the cat. Meow! He's just sleeping. But hold on, we did get some fish a little while ago when we were in the water area. So maybe it'll like that. Let's try this grilled fish. Here you go, kitty. Oh, I guess you have to put it down close enough. Then it smells it, it starts to wake up. Meow, meow! Ha, ah, the cat eats the fish. Meow! And, I wonder what the lady has buried here. Okay, because I don't think I can dig it up. Do I just have to speak to the lady now? Oh, there's one of those birds. Ah, uh, I was hoping that it would be a cuckoo. I need to find the cuckoos. Where are the cuckoos? Where could the cuckoos be? Oh, and this is the lady that we're looking for. It's so nice that we can jump higher. Look over there, you see that cat? Yeah, I already moved it. There's something important to me buried right where it's sitting. No, not right where it's sitting, where it was sitting. Maybe you could lure it away with something it likes. I did lure it away. But I can't dig. I don't have a shovel. Could there be a cuckoo in one of these crates? Everyone's so shocked that I broke that. Um... 
Um, how far away from town could the cuckoo possibly be? Probably not very far. There's another wolf. Oh yeah, that's right, the wolves are really strong enemies. I didn't use the wolves during my training earlier. Kind of forgot about getting that wolf. Okay, and I'm not expecting that a cuckoo is going to be inside one of the uh, houses. It's probably not going to be in a house. Wait, what is that? Oh, that's just a yellow bird. Okay, got some enemies and stuff here. Oh, there it is! Look, look, look! It's up on the roof there! That's such a funny spot for it. Okay, good thing I came closer and checked over here again. Okay, so let's go like this. Come on over here, and... Whoops! Let's get up. Oh, maybe I need a bed. And I just think I could jump onto anything now. Hey! Go. There we go. And... Let's fly down! It's so cool how you fall slowly while you are holding these. Okay, and... This should be the last one. One, two, three, four. Here's the last one. Come back! Don't worry, I'll bring it back. I'll bring it back. There you go! Got them all. Thank goodness you brought all my dear sweet cuckoos home. I'm so grateful. Please come this way. And? Thank you. I'm so glad my cuckoos are all back. As for why they ran away in the first place, I think the refreshing grapes I gave them for breakfast might have been too sour. My darlings can be rather picky eaters. Anyway, thank you. Here's a little reward for helping me and my little scabs. Hey, another jar! And you know what? We should go to the fairy because if we pay her, then we'll be able to wear another accessory. By the way, did you know if you lift a cuckoo over your head and jump from a high place, you'll glide through the air? Really, I suppose you could do that with any winged creature. Oh, maybe you can do that with pea hats also when you carry a pea hat. Let's see. Let's try it. Let's put down a pea hat. Can I lift it? And? Yeah, you do fall more quickly. That's kind of funny. Oh, and they're scared of that because they go, oh, monster. Okay, so I was able to move that cat that the lady was asking about. But how do I dig here? What can I do to dig? Do I have anything that will let me dig? I'd assume that I'd need a shovel to dig here. Or wait, no, I could use the moly moly guy. That's what I could use. That's right, I have the moly moly guy. I forgot about the moly moly guy. I'm guessing that's what we have to do. Hold on, is this the thing? Whole mill? And there we go! We got it! Alright, that's so great. I actually forgot about that. You found the secret stash. It's heavy with rupees. Haha, <laughs> and we just bring it to her. You dug up my secret stash! You're my hero, as promised. Let me give you these clothes for it. I buried it because I kept buying impulsively, but once I couldn't dig it up, I was in trouble. Anyway, I'm done denying my impulses now. Thanks so much, that's not good. Whoa, wait, 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 wait. Can I actually wear that as an outfit? It's like Cat Princess Peach, we now have Cat Zelda. It is an actual outfit! Let's equip it. Ha! <laughs> oh, that is too funny. The food you gave me earlier was yummy. I'm looking for a cat. The one that lives with the old man? No idea. Maybe one of the others know. That's so funny. Oh man, guys, this is incredible. What a great game. Okay, and we have to go to the fairy in a moment. We have to go to the fairy in a moment. Let's see, where is the... Where are the other cats? There have got to be some other cats around here. Let's see, we could go like this, get up here, get up here. Man, this is so cool. I could jump almost at the height of a tree. Okay, this isn't a cat, but we could still probably- Oh, there's a cat way up there. Whoa, look, I'm blowing hard enough to make the windmill spin. Ha ha ha, what a funny kid. Okay, we can... Put down a bed, then come up here. Whoa, that's a weird enemy up there. That's a really weird enemy up there. You know, maybe I should defeat you. Wait, Elden Volcano Trail. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I activated a cutscene or something. Try is looking around. I didn't want to go here yet. Okay, well, here we are. Elden Volcano. I guess we're going to be going here in a moment. Elden Volcano. Cool, lots of lava. Looks like a scary place to be. But yeah, I entered this from a weird place. Wow, that's a big mountain. But there should be somewhere I can make a rift entrance up there. I wonder where we can find the Gorons. Okay, I actually uh, want to get up to this cat here. We can probably just go like this, actually. Whoops, maybe not. Maybe we could go like this and like this. And there we go. Are you the cat that I need? Need something, hun? I'm looking for a cat. The old man's friend? I just saw her. She found a nice tree by the road from the east entrance in the village and climbed up for a nap. She takes long naps, so I'm sure she's still there. 
great to know. Okay, so that is somewhere to the east. Apparently. Let's see. Don't worry, sir. I'll find your cat. I'll find your cat. Should be a cat somewhere around here. Whoa, that was weird how I was able to get up there. Wait, that's not the cat, is it? No, that's not a cat. Wait, let's speak to this cat. You understand cats? That's rare for your kind. I'm looking for a cat. Oh, the cat that lives with the old men? I've been very busy sunbathing and don't know. Check with the one on top of the window. Oh yeah, that's what we heard already. A nice tree by the road from the east entrance to the village. Okay, a nice tree by the road. So that's gotta be somewhere around here, but where? Where could this cat be? We don't want to wander too far, but wait! No, that's not a cat, that's a bird, uh, that's a bird up there. What are you doing here, sir? Hello. Hi. Hi, hello! Acorn gathering, give it a go! Yeah, sure! Let's do some acorn yeah. gathering, why not? And I can jump high now, too. Oh. Alright, let's see. Oh, I just realized his hat is an acorn! That's so funny. Wait, how many do we have to collect? Looks like there are quite a few around here. You need to pick up 11 acorns in 40 seconds. Okay, let's go then. Let's go. Maybe this isn't the most efficient way to go. Let's go. There we go, very nice. Oh man, I was hoping that we'd be able to make it up there. Ah, enemies! How many more do we need? Oh, easy, 15 seconds, man! Being able to jump high makes that way too easy. Okay, what's prize time, 20 rupees? Yeah, okay, simple. Oh, we get a one-time special bonus. Oh, maybe the previous guy can do that too. Hold on, I have to add that to the to-do list. Cool. That's nice that we got that, but where in the world is the, uh... Uh-oh, man. Where in the world is the thing that we're looking for? The cat. Where could the cat be? Lots of enemies around, but where's the cat? Where's the cat? There's gotta be a cat around here somewhere, huh? Where's the cat? Oh cool, there's something that we could use to teleport to here, that's nice. And where are we? We're kind of near Hyrule Field, I guess. Okay, so you know what, the cat is probably up this way, just having looked at the map for a moment. Oh, I like how that guy jumped, that was kind of funny. Oh, now he finally noticed me. Okay, so this is the road from the east, wait. I wonder if we could get up onto those trees, that would be quite high to climb. I doubt that the cat is up here. Wait, can I stand here? I can't stand on that. Okay, wait, so maybe we can do this. Oh wait, I could just get up onto the trees here. That would make it even easier. I could go like this. And from here I could go like this. Like that. Like this, and... Cool, we can get up here. Whoa! Oh, that's so strange. I wonder if that's the edge of the map, if that's why we got brought back like that. That's so funny. Yeah, it's just, uh... I guess the game doesn't want us going up that way. Wait! We could definitely dig here. We could definitely dig here. We've seen these spots before. Let's go like this. Place them down. Dig! Yeah, there we go. I thought, wait, are you gonna dig or no? There's gotta be something there. Come on. Oh, we could enter here! Ah, and we get a heart piece! Oh, that's so sweet! That's so cool. Okay, now we could go down here. Oh, that looks like a thing that we could learn, actually. Ah, oh, now all of a sudden we are in this area here. Whoops. I want to be pushed off by accident. Go! <laughs> that was kind of funny. Okay, now let's see. Will this work? Okay, now we could probably get up like this. Whoa! Let's learn this ability. There we go. We learned it. Oh, the spiked roller echo. Maybe one is about to hit us too. Run! Nice job making it over that. Now, you know what? Maybe we do want to head down this way. Let's see what's down here. Okay, and then you could climb here. Or there. Could also go like this. Oh. Looks like we want to go there. Wait. Oh, this is the entrance. This is where you come in from. Okay, so, uh, yeah, we actually do want to continue that way. Yeah, we do want to continue that way. Okay, so, whoop -a. Let's go. You can climb here, go like this. Go! Climb, run! Run, Zelda! Okay, now, how are we going to make it past these? That is the question. Let's see. Let's go like this. Wait, maybe we could use the spider here to get up high. Go, spider! Is there nothing to grab onto there? Let's see. The spider can grab onto the ceiling there. 
But what can we do to make it past here? Can I throw one of these wooden rollers at it? What if we- Ow! No! Ow! My own wooden rollers are destroying me. What if I place down a boulder or something? Can that stop it? Let's see, will that make it through or no? Hey, there we go. Okay, easy. There we go. Oh, and I probably could have made it- Maybe I could have made it up to the ceiling there. Okay, where are these things coming from? From there. Let's see. Maybe I do want to go up there. Let's see if I do. Let's see. Go, spider! Let's push that over. Okay, now I can come over here. Doesn't look like there's anything there. Okay, so we can just continue this way, which is nice. Now, are they going to start coming this way? Okay, good. They're not coming this way yet. Go! Go, spider! Wait, can you attack them? Yeah, that's a good spider. Uh-oh! Move! Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm just gonna go like this. Whoops. Pick this up. Throw it over there. There we go. The spider's confused. It's going, wait, why are you doing that? Okay, maybe we could drop a roller here. And? Ha! I was hoping that the roller would be able to hit that. That's cool. Nice. Okay, let's jump down. Go. Jump down. There we are. And now we could just use a bed to get across here. Climb up here, and what's in this chest? Maybe a golden egg or something, or a monster thing? Yeah, a golden egg. Nice. Whenever you're somewhere where it's a bit of work like this, it seems like you often get a golden egg. Now wait, is this the exit? Yeah, that's the exit. Okay, that was a cool little place where we were. But we gotta find that cat. Where could that cat be? The cat's gotta be around here somewhere, right? Okay, up here is the acorn guy. And wait, 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 wait. I just saw somebody there. But wait, when we look at the map, I guess we're not allowed going to that area yet, because look, if we try and go over here... Yeah, we just get teleported back. Ah, but it looks like we can go there, it's just... We're not allowed to go there yet, because it's too... Early in the game for us, I guess. Probably the same thing if we head over this way, yeah. Okay, well, where's the cat? Huh? Where's the cat? That's what I want to know. That's what I want to know, that's what everybody's thinking right now, everybody is thinking, where's this cat right now? Where's this cat? That area over there is kind of suspicious to dig, too. Let's see, got a wolf and stuff down here. Maybe it'll be by- Oh, cool, a treasure chest over there. Another distraction. That's neat. Okay, lots of these bouncy guys here. But, we can just make it up like that, no problem. And in here is... Oh, nice, cool. We got a monster stone. Amazing, but where's the cat that we need? Hmm, where's this cat? Let's see, anything up there? Doesn't look like there's anything up there. Oh, I think this is actually where we came from. When we were first coming to this town, to Kakariko Village. Let's see, maybe there's some reason to want to go across that way. Are you guys gonna break these beds? Yeah, of course you are. Of course you are, you bed breakers, you. I can defeat you! Go! No, oh, no, don't hurt me! Get him! Okay, now maybe I can make some beds across here. Okay, good, we can make it to here, and... Any cats here? Not seeing the cats, where are the cats? Well, it's not like we need multiple cats, we just need to find the one cat. And so many of these guys are here. Okay, and then there's that entrance to the town, the south entrance. So the east entrance is around here. Where's this cat, though? This cat should still be sleeping here. Go, fight the wolf. Oh, that's a fast wolf. Get wrecked, wolf. Yeah, wolf is not a cat. A wolf is different from a cat. It might be similar. It might be easy to confuse the two. You know what? We should dig here. Molly, Molly, please dig. Anything there? Nope. Oh, cool. Got a monster fang. That's nice. But where's the cat? Oh, look, a treasure chest is just right here. Okay, sure. I guess we could open this one. And in here is 20 rupees. Haha. <laughs> Yeah, that was an easy one. It's just there. Okay, got sneaky snakies here. Oh, look, there's a treasure chest over here in some ruins or something. Let's go like this. And we can open up this. And we get... What is that, a potato? Five rock potatoes. Ha ha. That's pretty funny. Like, rock and potato. A portmanteau of those two things. Now, we want to get up somewhere is the question. Probably. 
Oh, yep, of course. Of course there's gonna be a heart piece here. Let's go like that, and there we are. Very nice. But now the question is... Where's the cat? Oh, cool. There's just stairs leading down here. Probably to some kind of little ruins or something. We keep getting little distractions. Oh, nice. We just get one of these right here. That's nice. A mite crystal. And that fully fills up, so that's nice. Now, what is in here? This area is kind of suspicious. What is this down here? Oh, we could continue down, okay. Alright, now we're in a 2D... Oh, Royal Family Shortcut! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute, is this gonna bring us back into Hyrule Castle? Because this seems familiar, but it's just like what we did before, but backwards. Let's see if that's where we are going to end up. I think it might be... Oh, cool, and a treasure chest. And it is... Oh, nice, a golden egg. Wow, I wasn't expecting that, actually. Now, what's up here? Oh, maybe it's just a one-way exit, because normally we just hop in here while we are exiting, because this area seems so familiar. This is maybe one of the exits that we took near the beginning of the game when we were first making it out of here. That's what this area reminds me of, actually. Okay, so let's go like this. So nice that we can jump up to the height of crates now. I wonder if the item that we have that boosts our jump height, if it also boosts Link's jump height even farther now. Yeah, because I think that the reason that we couldn't get that Mike Crystal before is because this area was um, covered by rifts before, so that's why we couldn't go there. Now wait, is this the water that pushes us? Yeah, okay, but is there anything we want anywhere? Let's see. Wait. Oh no, I don't have control right now, so I can't go there to the right. Yeah, and we get washed up over here. This is where we were at the beginning of the game. You guys remember this? You guys remember this? I remember this. Yeah, we washed up over here. This is where we started the game. And is there anything over here that we might have missed? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. So let's see, maybe we will want to just climb up somewhere here. Maybe we could go like this. Let's try this. Hopefully these slimes don't destroy us. Go like this. And is that high enough? Yeah, it is. Okay, cool. Now we can go up here. And this is basically the desert. Yeah, here's the desert. Oh, and there was some stuff up here at the top of the desert that I wanted to check out too. You know what? We could basically go straight up from here because yeah, there is something at the desert that I wanted. So that I wanted to see. Oh, and look, a stamp. There's another stamp. That's nice. Four out of five stamps. Looks like we only need one more. I wonder if that stamp could have been around before, but we just didn't see it. Okay, there's Fishy Fishy and Tornado Guy. Oh, the Tornado Guy just pushed us a little bit. Let's see. Come on up here. Okay, where I want it. What the? Oh, okay, that looked different to me. This is an area that I wanted to check out. Oh, can we not go into any of these? I was thinking that maybe we would now be able to enter some of these now that the rifts are cleared here. But it looks like we actually- uh-oh. Whoa, that's so weird. That's a spot where you could get stuck. And yeah, from there I can't jump. You could only move around. So there are some spots in the game like that where you could just get stuck. And there's nothing you can do to move. You can't jump or anything, so the game just responds you. Where you last landed, I guess. That's kind of funny that there's another spot like that. That has happened to me before. Okay, so let's see. What if we go up here? We can get up here and... Anything nice up here? Wait, this is kind of an unexplored area here. Just south of Hyrule Ranch. We haven't really looked around there much. So maybe we can look over there and see what's going to be there. Aw, oh, it's so nice that we could jump so high. Let's see, what's here? I guess we're coming here. This is suspicious. Yeah, that's way too suspicious. Good thing I cut that grass there. Got a mic crystal, very nice. Okay, and we could probably upgrade our arrows some more. Is there anything else down here? Because you know what, we still gotta find the cat. You have to find the cat. Oh, nice. And... Oh, and there's a stamp right there in front of this. Wait, so that means that we're going to have five now. So that means that we're going to have a card filled up. Does that mean we're going to get another one soon? Let's see what happens. There we go. We filled it up. And... Yeah, I'm expecting the guy to come. Hey! Yeah, it's a stamp guy. Here he comes. Down he comes. I'm ready for him. Yeah! 
Hello again! Stamp Guy here! I've loved stamps since I was a small fry, now I'm Hyrule's biggest collector! Oh, you found five stands and filled your stamp card! Here's your reward, as promised! Wait, just milk? Uh, I was hoping that it'd be a heart piece or something. So, what'd you think? Like the stamp rally? I had a great time. I knew you would! I worked so hard on this! Wowee! I can do a backflip! Everyone's gonna see how fun stamps are! That's why I'm traveling the world spreading the news about my big stamp rally! Though, you're the only one playing. Anywho, here's your next stamp card! Nice. You got the exciting stamp card. This one is for intermediates. The back is soaked through with various colors of ink. Nice. And do I get one to start or no? Okay, all together now. Ready, set, go, stamp rally. The fun continues. All right, that's fine. Nice, and we got some apples there. Okay, now let's see. Do I want a horse? I don't really care too much for a horse. Anything around here? Doesn't really look like it. Wow, we filled up... It looks like quite a bit of the map, but it also kind of looks like only about half of the map. Fair and wetlands look huge. And there's this mountainous area here. Yeah, there's still probably quite a bit left to the game. Okay, so where could this cat be? We've got to find a cat. There's a cat in a tree somewhere. Where's the cat in the tree? Cat in the tree. Cat in the tree. Cat in the tree. Cat in the tree. Oh, I guess this is the way up to uh, the volcano that you're normally supposed to take. Past this ridge is Elden Volcano. The trail will take you up to Goron City. There's a bunch of hot springs in that area, too. I want to take a nice long soak in one. That's fine. Wait, this one is so suspicious. Isn't it? Look at this one. This one's different from the others. Why? What do you have to say about this? I'd like to help out in Goron City, but it's not an easy climb for us, and it's not long before you run into monsters. Well, I guess we could look a bit to the west, too, because what if the cat messed up its east and west directions? That's a possibility. I kind of doubt it, but that is a possibility. Those enemies, I remember them from Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. That was a fun game. Okay, now where could the cat be? Where's the cat, huh? Could it be around here? Probably not. There's the potion shop. Oh, wait, I guess all of the uh, little green marks on here are all trees. So we could do this to make sure that we check every single tree. I guess we could do that. I could even print out a zoomed in version of this. I could take a screenshot of it and print it. And then look for the cat, because where's this cat? This cat is so hidden. Maybe they meant somewhere along one of these trees? There it is! I see the cat! Uh, how many times did I walk by here? How many times did I walk by here before noticing that cat? My goodness! There we go, this has got to be the one. Hello, cat. Huh? I was asleep? What's going on? Oh, my person friend is looking for me. Not owner, person friend. That's so funny. I guess I have been sleeping here a long time. Hungry too. Guess I'll head home for a snack. That is exactly how I imagine cats think. Okay, but that's great that we took care of that one. Oh man, some of those pink birds are sometimes fast when they attack me. I wish they were that fast when they were attacking other people. I'm so relieved! Oh, it's you! My kitty came home! You helped her home, didn't you? Please, take this as a token of my gratitude. Grapes! All of that work just for grapes! I can't believe it. Cats are such fickle little creatures, following their fancy wherever it takes them. But I suppose that's what we find so adorable about the rotten beasts. Ah, very nice. We got that. Okay, and you know what? There was someone in the desert oasis that wanted to see, uh... The flying tiles, so let's go to him. Maybe we could show him those now. Oh, and maybe I could cook some more recipes. I could cook up some more stuff now. Where could they be? Are you the person that wanted to see the floating tiles? Well, I've never used it, so it must be near the end somewhere. This must be it. Flying tile. Whoops, wrong button. It is this one. That's what you wanted. Whoa! Is this the flying tile that Facet spoke about? You've got to show me that again. Show me a bunch. Oh, I thought I'd actually have to put down a few. But they just say that. All right, now that I've seen the tiles with my own eyes, I can share what I learned with my boss. Thank you. You've been a huge help. Please, take this as a payment for your assistance. Oh, nice. 50 rupees. That's nice. Nice that we're getting some more money. Oh, and we also have to, uh... Wait, she does make a point of researching in the ruins, looking for useful things to bring to town. She's so incredibly selfless. I aspire to be like her. Yeah, that is a good quality of a leader. And we have to go to the fairy soon, but first, let's make some smoothies. Let's see, what else did we get? I thought we got something new. Oh, yeah, rock tato. When used in a drink, it grants the drinker a boost to wall climbing speed. Interesting. We could probably try that with floral nectar, maybe that with butter, and maybe that with milk. Let's try this. You got it. 
We get? Oh, we got something. Sweet climbing smoothie, nice. Oh, you've got too many drinks, gotta make some space first. Wait. Uh, I guess we have to sell some of our drinks then, because we have the maximum amount, I guess. Hmm, makes you climb faster. That might be useful, maybe, if I want to climb really quickly and there are obstacles being shot at us. I imagine that could actually be useful in the volcano. Let's sell the unfortunate smoothies, I guess, to make some room. Is there anything I don't care about? Energy recovery and glow, energy recovery. Oh, dive up to one minute. That's nice, lets you hold your breath underwater. That heals quite a bit of HP. That also heals quite a bit of HP. This one doesn't heal as much and it makes you glow, so let's just sell that. Okay, let's sell another unfortunate smoothie to get some room. Let's get some room. That's a lot of health, it heals. Sweet tough smoothie, that heals so much HP. And let's sell that one, there we go. Now let's make some more. Let's do rock and milk, and then we could also try rock and butter. wonder if rock and salt would do anything. We get... Milky climbing smoothie, ha, ah, nice. Let's do rock and butter. That could be good. And we get... Mixed climbing smoothie, nice. I wonder if we could do something like rock and cactus. It's probably gonna be a fail, but let's try it. Wait. Oh, mixed climbing smoothie, it ends up being the same, interesting. Okay, so there are a few things that we need to do around Seaside Village, which is all the way over here. It's so nice that you can warp, I love that you can warp. But there are a few things that I want to do here that I missed, like... This right here, where's my bomb? There we go. Please explode here. And let's see what's in here now. Oh, it's just a chest. I thought that it was actually going to be a big dungeon or something. But you actually just get 20 rupees for that, but nice that we were able to do that. Now... Whoa, man, nice that I made it up there. Anything special up here? Don't know if I really explored this area up here too much. Did I? Let's see, what could be up here? Because, you know what, there are actually a few other things. Wait, that area right there is so suspicious. I was thinking, you know what, we gotta look around here a little bit. Right here, we definitely need a moly moly guy. Whenever I see one of these spots now, I think, yeah, we've got to dig, because look at that. We get a mite crystal. Wait, someone's speaking here. Oh, can the cats give you quests too? Oh, you could understand me, how unusual. It may surprise you, but I'm a well-traveled lady from the desert. See my friend there? I met her right here in Jebel Waters at the end of my travels. I adore her, but the fish she provides simply don't suit my palate. Do you want some fish? So every day she fishes and fishes, hoping to catch something I like. Do I have to give her a fish, maybe? It's frankly adorable. Bless her giant heart. Ha 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 ha. The cat's so funny. Which is why I would like to give her a treat. Where I come from, the people make a smoothie that I hear is absolutely delectable. Oh, probably a cactus smoothie or something. It's called a Warmix Spatial? Something along those lines. Oh, I haven't made anything like that. I'm sure if you speak to a smoothie person in the desert, they'll know what you're after. Once you have it, check in with me. Then give it to my person friend. I'll reward you handsomely. Interesting. Okay, I thought that I'd have to give her a fish or something. I thought that I'd have to spawn an echo of a fish inside the water. And then the person will go, wow, look at this good fish I caught. Okay, now hold on. There was a person somewhere around here. I think it might be in here, actually, that we have to give the fish to. I think the person might have been here. Whoa! Did I not defeat these guys? That's actually kind of surprising. I would have thought that I would have defeated these guys. Whoa! What is that that we just got? This looks like something new. Monster Guts! That sounds quite brutal, doesn't it? Okay, there's another guy we defeated. And let's defeat you. And now we can open this chest. Wait. The option for open popped up as that guy was defeated before this disappeared. So I wonder if you could actually hit open before uh, that disappears, and what would happen if you do that? Okay, so now we want to give some fish to this guy, because this guy is sleeping. Ah, yeah, Mom, where's my snack? Okay, did we use the fish yet? Yeah, here's fish. There we go. We've used this fish twice now. Sniff, sniff. Smells good, but not like Mom. Wait, what do you mean? What do you mean? This is the one that we were supposed to bring. Oh, maybe you're not supposed to bring an echo. Maybe we have to bring the actual fish itself so that it is fresh. And then I have to carry it across here. Well, it's a good thing that I defeated those uh, enemies first. 
Let's come down here. Is my ship still zappy? Oh wow, so many side quests. Let's talk to this lady first though. Oh, you're back. I'm guessing that the grilled fish for my son went bad. Well, here, I'll give you another one. I guess we have to specifically bring over this one. All right, it's ready. Good thing I stocked up. My son should be in the woods north of here. Thanks for taking this to him. Watch out for the hungry monsters. Yeah, so I guess I have to carry this over. Is my ship still zappy? Yeah, we have to go there in a moment. Now wait, do we go up this way? Is this the way that we went? I think we went up here. Yeah, now we just have to get over there. Should I place or toss here? Let's see. Place. No, I guess I have to toss. No! Oh wait, I can still get it. Wait, lift. Nice! What if I throw it across? Okay, then I could come to here. Pick it up. Hey, that worked great. That was amazing. Oh, I'm so glad that worked out. Okay, can I throw it up there? Nope. So I have to probably make a bed or something. Uh, maybe I should make them closer, actually. Let's go like this. Let's put this down. And we can make some beds here. One, two, three, four. That should work. Now, how high can we get this? Let's go. Throw! Nice, nice, nice. We can pick it up here. Throw it there. And there we go. Wait! No, no, but I'm way back here! And my beds all disappeared, so I fell down here. He's not gonna know how this fish got here. Yeah, something smells amazing! My mom's grilled fish! You came all this way to bring it to me! Who is you? I'm not there! I'm down here! He didn't see me here! He woke up after the fish got here! I'm not even near him! Thanks! I'm starving! Who is he even speaking to? Time to dig in. The grilled fish is the best! So is my mom! Haha, <laughs> delicious! My tummy is satisfied! Tell my mom thanks! I'm gonna get in a nice post-meal nap here! Haha, <laughs> yeah, that's so funny because I'm down here, so he didn't even see me at all! Rumble, rumble! Mom, no! Tanglers are gross, even if you grill them! Ha 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 ha! He doesn't like the tangler fish. And we've used some tangler fish in this game before. Okay, so let's go back to the mom, and let's see what she has to say. Hello there, ma'am. Is he coming home? Did you deliver the grilled fish to my son? Thank you so much! He says he still wants to rest. Oh, he went back to sleep after eating it? That boy, I swear he spends the entire day just sleeping or eating. Oh, sorry, just thinking aloud again. I'll get you a reward for your hard work. I'm grateful for your help. Please, take this. Ah, just kelp. Don't really care for that, but that's nice. I'll leave some grilled fish here, too. Take as much as you want. Nice. Now, what does this guy have to say? Oh, wait, and here's a cat. Living in this village is all you can eat fish. That said, when you eat fish all the time, you kind of want to switch it up every so often, too. Ha ha. I wonder if I could jump off the cat. Probably not. Okay, let's put down a bed. And I can get up here. Is my ship still zappy? Hey, you! Seen the big ship out there? The one in the southwest waters? I have, yeah, I've been there. Well, that's my ship. It's fallen on hard times. A real wreck now, too. When I was a young sailor, I wanted to rule the Herulean Seas. A dream that takes oh. zip. But when I got my ship out there, I ran right into rocks. The hull got gashed open. I swam back to shore. Kind of feeling sunk myself, but I haven't given up on that dream. I've been making repairs ever since. Slow work, but I'm getting there. Now my ship's been claimed by a monster that I can't hear. It zap, zap, zaps. At this rate, my ship's gonna be sunk. Then I'll be sunk. My dream. Gone. I don't stand a chance against that monster. Take someone with real zap to defeat a monster that zaps. I can say, I'm zippy. Or sorry, that's not me. Ah, yeah, I know the look in your eye. Same luck I used to see in mine. Now listen up. I shut the ship's hatch nice and tight to keep people safe from the monster. You gotta use a lot of force to pry that thing off. Then you can get inside. That monster is a huge jellyfish. Its feelers will make you zappy if you touch it. Be careful. All right, let's go to that ship. Yeah, because I was wondering about that ship. I thought, why is there just a ship here? But it makes sense that it's something that is used for a side quest. So let's see, where is this ship? It's gotta be around here somewhere, right? Let's check the map. Okay, it's just to the left a little bit. If only we could swim a little bit faster. Now, hold on. Oh, I guess we have to take off that lid there. This here. Oh, and there's another shark. Jump up. Oh, sharky, sharky. Guess I gotta fight you with my shark, huh? You know what they say, fight sharks with shark. Go, shark. There we go, get that shark. Hey! Don't attack me. That shark deals massive damage. My goodness. Just one hit dealt three points of damage to me. Took away three of my hearts. Okay, let's pull this off. And there should be a Zappy Zappy monster in there. I wonder if it's gonna be the normal Zappy Zappy monster or a level two Zappy Zappy jellyfish. Let's see. This reminds me so much of Legend of Zelda Wind Waker right here. Let's go. You can probably destroy those. Nice. I'll just check what's here while we are here. And let's see. What else could be in here? Come here. Oh, nice, that hit worked, that's great. Let's just start destroying everything. Okay, getting lots of kelp, which is nice. 
Yeah, a lot of kelp. Kelp everywhere. Kelp, kelp everywhere, but not a drop to drink. Let's go. Nice. Got a heart, too. Oh, I felt that maybe we could... Oh, wait, that's the ceiling. Ah, let's just go like this. There we go. Where's the zappy zappy monster? Oh, oh, we have to continue down. Wow, I like that it was the final thing that we broke. Okay, let's go through. And now... Oh, I guess part of the fun here is trying to find where you have to go. Oh wait, actually, we just walk down here. I was thinking we had to find another secret entrance, but it looks like we could just go through here. We have a lot of grapes. Man, this is a pretty big ship, isn't it? No! Don't hurt me! Get him. Thank you. Thank you. Now you're gonna jump here, aren't you? Come here. Get him. Good job. Go get that guy. Okay, and there are spiky spikies down there too. I see the spiky spikies down there. I don't think we have to defeat all of these guys. Wow, the ship is kind of waterlogged, isn't it? Okay, let's see. I guess we can continue here. Oh, there's a five rupee right there. Ah, we have enough money. That's okay. Oh, and there's a chest up there. That's nice. And in the chest is... Probably money. Oh, more rock potatoes. That's nice. Rock potatoes. That's great. Wait, let me check what stuff we're wearing. Okay, this makes materials appear more, and we can jump higher, which is great. Oh, and we have a scroll from the master that makes you use energy more slowly in fight master form. Or in a sword fighter form, I should say. Okay, let's see. Apples. Oh, and I guess we want to continue down there in a moment. Let's go. I wonder if we are going to need uh, any of our potions that let us hold our breath for longer underwater. Let's see, is it going to be dark here at all? Not really. You know what? It is kind of dark. Let's use our angler. Where's our angler? There he is. Or sorry, tangler, not angler. Let's see. Nice. A treasure chest down here. Nice. 50 rupees. That's great. Okay, and let's see. Anything up here or no? Okay, I guess that's just the default path. Let's go and defeat this guy. Hey. Let's go attack this guy. There we go. Get him. When I need some bubbles. I guess I could go up here for bubbles. Very nice. Now the question is, is this a main path? Whoop, there's another one of those guys. Or do we want to go that way? Oh, this is probably the zappy guy that we have to defeat here. I, whoop. Nope, maybe that's not the special zappy guy, because there are a few of these zappy guys here. Go, 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 go. Good job, guys. But wait, it looked like there was something. Oh, no, I don't want to continue yet, actually. Let me go back. Because there might be some other stuff there. Okay, so before we continue, let's come down here. And let's take care of this stuff. Let's defeat that guy there. Go defeat him. Go. Attack him. Come on. There we go. Good job, guys. Okay, now get out of the way so I can get this five rupee over here. And maybe, just maybe, there is a possibility that something that we want to do is go up here, because we don't know where this leads. Oh, is that just a dead end? Okay, that's actually just a dead end. Okay, so I came back just for a dead end. Okay, so let's go back to where we were up here, up this way. Okay, so let's continue up this way, and let's see where we will go. Where will we be? Okay, lots of beds around. Oh, and another treasure chest. That's nice. Oh, man, this place is getting a little complicated, isn't it? I'm surprised at how big this ship is, because on the outside, it looks like it's just a small ship. Once you're inside, this place is huge. Okay, so let's put down some beds. And then maybe now we can continue up here, or not yet. Okay, maybe one more. Wait, that's a ceiling. Oh, okay, good, good. We can get through. Yeah, because we are hitting our head on the ceiling here. We can make it through here. Oh, oh, I see what we have to do. Okay, let's grab that. Let's come on over. Uh bit more. Oh, and I have to get some height over here, too. I guess I should make the beds going the other way. That would actually be easier if I make the beds going this way. There we go. Now I can just bring this guy over like this. And there we go. Activated the switch. Yeah, I was thinking of getting him to the right height, going to the right, and then popping out and then dragging him over to the right, but that way's definitely better. Whoa! Those are some big blobby blobbies. And, nice, we defeated those very quickly. That's very nice. You learned the Hydrozzle Echo. And there's also a Po-Soul. 
that we could get. Whoops. Well, I guess we're switching to this guy right away. Go. 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 Nice. Let's go. This seems like it's a good way to go. Just get him with the arrows. There we go. We defeated him. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, used up about half of our ability. What about this guy? Oh, I thought that was a new guy, but it looks like it wasn't. Is there anything here to the left that we missed? Yes. Look at this. There's something that we could explode right here. Wait, come here. Need you to explode this. And? Secret entrance? Or what? Okay, lots of boxes to break. Maybe we'll just put down some bombs. Uh-oh. You can only use one at a time, I guess. Okay, that was a good way to get rid of a bunch of those. Oh, and look, there's a chest right there. Okay, maybe. Stay here. Come up. There we go, got rid of... Oh, I have to get rid of these, that's so funny. Okay, let's just go like this. Because, yeah, I can't open the chest with the crates on top of it like that, which is pretty funny. And in here is... Whoa! 300 rupees? Not 100, but 300? My goodness, good thing you could go over a thousand. Imagine if I was at 900 something and we got 300 and then we only got boosted to, uh, 999. But it's funny, in The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess, I remember in that game what would happen is if you couldn't hold the rupees, you'd put them back in the chest, which is pretty funny. Okay, now then, I guess we can continue across this way. And we can go and get that chest. Don't have to be scared of going into the water. What's in here? Nice, another 20. 20 doesn't seem like that much after we just got 300. That's unbelievable. Okay, and I guess I could just hit this guy with a sword. There we go. Nice quick way to do that. And let's come on down and get that kelp. 43 bubble kelp. That's a lot of bubble kelp. Hold on. I'm a little suspicious of that. Okay, I guess we could just have that rupee there. That's fine. Get anything nice here? Just gotta break everything, because we don't know where anything really special could be. Let's see. Okay, nice. Let's keep going through. Oh, he wasn't kidding about a big zappy thing. He was not joking about that. Okay, this looks like this is some kind of optional boss fight or something, maybe. Wait, I wonder if I have to specifically get the ones that... Ah! Okay, let's send out another one. Come on, there's got to be a chance to get you now, right? Go attack! Okay, nice, defeated one of them. Whoa! Well, this seems like a good way to go. I guess I could also turn into... Oh, don't get zapped. Okay, let's send out another one. Go! Oh, another electric ball is being sent out here. Go! Yes, keep going! Go! Yes! Good job, attack another one! Okay, never mind, you got caught. I was thinking that uh, turning into the uh, turning into Link could be a good idea. Because maybe if I turn into Link, then I can attack these guys with arrows. Yeah, that's good. Let's go. There we go. Oh man! Good thing I didn't go closer. I'd love to get those hearts there. But let's see. What can we do? What can we do? Got a few of those left. I'm just going to these pots over here. And you know what? Maybe hitting them now with pots could be a good idea. I missed! Go get that one. Nice. Go get another one. Oh, nope. That's it. Okay, just two left. Almost there. Almost there. Come on now. Wait, I wonder if I could send out one of the electric guys to fight them. Wait, that's not who I wanted to send out. You know what? Let's try it. How will you do? Can you go get him or no? Let's see. Okay, that doesn't look like it works. What about sending out one of these? Nope. Uh, you know what? Let's just attack while we're here. Go! Now run away! And send out a shark and run! No, shark! You should attack the little ones! Go, shark! Give me that part there. Very nice. Hey! Hey, they keep sending out more! If you're too slow, do more of them get sent out? That's not good. Let's see. Oh, this is my chance to attack. Oh, no, but I'm going to get zapped, I think. Let's see. I could go like this. There we go. And? I guess I could go like this. Wait, are they invincible right now? Maybe they're invincible right now. Oh, and I'm out of that power. That's not good. That's not good. Okay, let's go. Attack shark. And go. Attack shark. No! 
Ooh, shark, why wouldn't you attack the other one? Okay, now are you gonna send out one more jellyfish or two? Please, just one. Good, 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 that's fine, that's fine. And wait, can I attack you with this? That'd be great if I could just attack you with this. Well, let's see, let's get ready. Let's get ready, okay? Now I need a shark, go shark. And that one. No, shark, this one, obviously, go. Yes, there we go. Okay, now, what can I do to attack you? I guess probably this. Go. Keep going. You know what? Can this guy attack faster? Go. Yeah, there we go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He's angry. Oh, man. Wait, they're not gonna roam around freely now, are they? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's an electric Beyblade. Very, very dangerous. Come now, go, attack. Nice job, taking out a few of them. Good job, good job, good job, you took out a few. Now it's probably gonna do a big electric attack, yeah. Okay, that was good, we got a few of them there. Now can you get any of them? Is there a chance? Let's see. Let's see, you're probably gonna stop soon. Let's see, go. No, oh, why is that electric? That shouldn't be. Go, no, run! Ah, too bad I couldn't get that last one there, almost got it. Oh wait, were there two left? I don't know if there were two left or if one more came there. Let's see. Let's see, let's get ready, okay. That's about to run out. No, it sent out another one, that's not good. Go. What's going on? What's going on? Is it too high? Can you not hit them? What in the world was happening there? That was so strange. That one doesn't look like it's electric. Looks like we could hurt that one. Yes! Okay, hurt that one, that's good, okay. Two left. Uh-oh, run! Okay, now go. Get these last two, please. Get the last one, please, please, get it. Why is it so high? Why is it so high? I couldn't reach it. And another one came out. And now they're both electrified. Uh-oh, I actually got hurt a tiny, tiny bit there. That's okay. Okay, now go. Go, you can get him. And you can get this one. Go. There we go! Let's go! Attack now. And... Attack. And is it defeated? Too bad I couldn't attack it with the sword because I ran out of my... Whoa! Look at all that money! That's a lot of money. And a heart piece instead of an actual heart, which is kind of funny. That's nice. Hooray! A piece of a heart. Let's get out of here. I'm guessing this teleports us back. Wait. Just to here? Oh, that was the first room. Okay, so that makes sense. Okay, so... Let's just teleport to... Whoops. Let's just teleport to here. Then we can go to the guy. Let's go to this guy. Flushy, flushy. Wait, what if I put a bed here? Is this guy gonna stop running around? Ha <laughs> ha. That stops him in his tracks. That's funny. I saw a whole lot of something happening way out at my ship. Some flashy, flashy stuff. That because of you? Did you take down that zappy monster? Yes, I did, sir. Hey, that took real zip, kid. You saved my ship and saved me from feeling so sunk. I'm gonna work on rebuilding my ship so we can stand up to anything. And then, adventure! Well, you zippy kid, you've got my thanks. Take this. You've earned it. Another fairy jar. That's amazing. Okay, so we definitely have to go to the, uh... Getting a ship fixed up isn't easy, but I've got the gumption to get it done. Yeah, we definitely have to go back to the, uh... Great Fairy Fountain. Okay, now where was the acorn guy again? Because I know that we have to go to the acorn guy. I know that the smoothie guy is just to the right of Crossflow Plaza's here. The acorn guy has to be nearby too. Okay, here he is, here he is. This is the guy. Hello there, sir. Hello, I need him. You need three pieces of bubble kelp? Now I've got him. I can't thank you enough, you saved my bar. I've learned my lesson. That's the last time I snack on ingredients. Ha 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 ha. Thank you, and to celebrate the big day, here's this. Oh, 20 rupees, nice, thank you. Don't spend it all in one place, unless it's here. That's such a good lie, that's so funny. Ah, uh, feels like I've turned over a new leaf. Very nice, helped out another guy. Okay, now where's the acorn guy? Oh, and is there something here? This area seems suspicious, doesn't it? Doesn't this seem like the kind of place where they would hide something? Oh, some kind of bird up there. Okay, that bird just runs away, that's fine. Is there really nothing on this beach here? That's so suspicious, this beach is way too suspicious. Way too suspicious, if you ask me. Okay, the acorn guy is probably somewhere up here. This area, yeah, 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 it's right up here. This area looks familiar to me, okay. And now that we, wait, can I defeat the enemies first? 
Will they actually be defeated when we do the uh, main stage? When we get to the main event, the acorn part of the event, or no? Okay, and I could jump onto there. Oh, and I can make that jump. This is crazy. We are going to do great, I think. I can go like this. Then I can go like that and make it to there. And I can even make that jump. This is wild. Okay, can I place down a bed here? No. Maybe I have to go like this. Okay. There we go. Now I can make it to this guy. Okay, okay, okay. Here's the acorn guy. Maybe if we do this fast enough, he will also give us a heart piece. Because from the previous guy... Or sorry, not from the previous guy. From the last guy that we just did, which was the second acorn guy that we ran into. When we did it quickly enough, we actually uh, did get a heart piece from him, which was quite the surprise. I wonder... If I could go like this. Oh, I can't make it to there right away. Okay, that's fine. Okay, but these guys are still here. Uh-oh. Let's go like this. Dive. And come on up. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Jump up. And... There we go. 17 seconds. Alright, hopefully we can get a heart piece for that. Let's see. Nice work! You got all the acorns, and your time was 17.11! You were amazing! Alright then, it's prize time! Okay, thanks for the 20 rupees. And, wow, that was lightning fast! So fast, in fact, that you get this special one-time bonus! Whoa! A hundred rupees! Okay, I thought he was gonna give us a, uh, heart piece, because that's what the other guy gave us. That's kind of surprising. Okay, let's see if we can do it in under 15 seconds. I think we can. I think we can. I think we can do it. Whoops! Maybe not at this rate. Let's come on up. Come on up. Go. Go. And... Easy! Almost under 13 seconds. We got it in just over 13 seconds. That's kind of funny. Okay, let's see. Time was 13.03. So we get 20 rupees and maybe he's gonna give us a seahorse or something also. But let's see. Yeah, a seahorse. A river horse, actually. Sorry, not a seahorse because this isn't the sea. Okay, so the Great Fairy Shrine is over here. So we definitely want to head over there because we want some more fairies. And if we pay the fairy some money, then we can also increase the number of accessories that we could wear at a time. Okay, so let's go here. Will you join me? Yeah, there we go. It's gonna be so nice to have multiple fairies in jars. I think that will make some of the boss fights quite easy. Very nice. A fairy jumped into your bottle. Amazing. Now, do we have three of them? Look at that. Three of the fairy bottles. Oh, and these are all stamp cards, I guess. Wow, so there are probably quite a few stamps in the game. Oh, hold on. What was that uh, climbing thing that we could buy? How many coins was that? Or how many rupees, I guess? Okay, well, let's speak to the fairy. We'll do maybe one or two upgrades here. And that accessory that lets us climb faster might maybe be more... Might maybe be useful. Okay, make me more stylish. Oh, looking to polish your style? Oh, well, I'm afraid. The cost has risen to 300 rupees. Yeah, that's what it was. Let's do it. Oh, how I adore rupees. As promised, I will enhance your style. Blow some fairy dust onto us. And? What's that do? Your accessory limit has been raised by one. With even more rupees, I can make you even more stylish, you know? Can I help you? Let's have a look at our accessories first. I love this frog jumping one. This one is so cool. And you know what? This one is kind of cool. You could get more monster stones. Wait. Oh, smoothie ingredients and monster stones. Okay, got it. And this one seems to be really cool. The heart one could also be useful. This one is really context dependent. And let's see, how much would it cost for another upgrade? Looking to polish your style? 500 rupees! Ah, uh, that's a little steep. But you know what? We have all this money. We're doing all these side quests. We're getting so much money. What else are we going to do with our money? Why not do it? Why not do it? Maybe there's going to be something really important that we need soon and we're going to need a lot of rupees for that. Hopefully that isn't the case and then we have to just grind for rupees. Your accessory limit has been raised by one. Mm, with even more rupees, I can make you even more stylish. How much is it now? Uh? This will be the last time, so I must insist on a thousand rupees. Wow. Mm. Okay, so I'm almost at the max upgrade there. It almost seems like we are getting towards the end of the game if we have so many things near the max upgrade. Okay, there's the Blueberry's house, so let's go there next and upgrade our sword slash arrows some more. Okay, let's see. We've got to go in here, and let's see what we can upgrade. Wait! Oh, you can upgrade the sword even more, you say? No time like the present. Give it a try. What do you want to enhance? Oh, and we can upgrade our energy even more. 
Hmm. Well, we have something that slows down. We have an accessory right now that slows down how quickly we use our energy. Oh, and I could wear a fourth one also. That's pretty cool. Don't really care too much for having four of them. Yeah, I can't equip five. I could only equip four right now. The max that you could equip is five. Okay, you know what, guys? Let's go to the Kakariko Village shop. Hold on, where was the shop? Wait, was the shop right here at the entrance? Yeah, this is the shop right by where this lady was that gave us the cat suit. And how much was this uh, climbing band? 500 only. Okay, that's not bad at all. I'll buy it. Now we can climb more quickly. Nice. Protects your wrist, helping you climb ladders and rock walls faster. That could be nice. Thanks. Yeah, not a problem. Okay, so let's take off the heart appearing one. And let's have this one on instead. I think that's a pretty good setup for now. Okay, I am really happy with this. We're making amazing progress in this game. Now the next thing that we have to do is just head up there towards the volcano, up the mountain. Another incredible game on the Nintendo Switch was Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door, the HD remake. We 100% completed that game. It was a long journey, but an incredible journey. And you might like that one if you enjoyed this one. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you have an amazing day ahead of you. And take care, everybody.